24 and 0. 21 via knockout. See him moving up a couple of weight classes. He said, everyone tells me. Listen, even if he wastes this first round, moving. Garcia has gone the distance 12 rounds in each of his. He was touching. At least he was touching. Nothing solid landed from either guy, but he was touching. He's doing stuff. A little spot for that move. And there goes the game right now because both of them are very, very top down a little bit. Mike and that, and that uh, tied Mike Chang. Uh, Tell Brook did was he he, he used a, a lot of cute moves, but nobody's really dominating the rounds yet. Looks like Arrow wants to start pressuring a little harder, but right when he dabs down to the body and trying to counter, so it's a it's a cat and mouse game. He landed playing it smart and he's being effective. There's oh, a big left by Spam. Ooh. Oh. I just told him to take him pose, keep his jab, stay focused, and don't get reckless. It says here in round number three. As you just see right there, popping him with the jab, and it's scoring for me, and I'm sure it's probably scoring. 21 for Spence, 11 oh, by Garcia. Big. The long arms are posing a problem for Mikey. He's, He's really having a hard There's the left by Spence. Great round for Spence right now. He's been throwing that right left continuously. Back to Heidi Andro. Heidi. Thank you very much, Robert. We heard you say this is the round you need to go for. What do you want to see Mike be doing? I think Mike could back him up. Boxing. Arrow Spence. And and he's he's in the fourth round, Spence landed what Garcia with a good start here in the fifth, but Spence has worked his way back. Mikey Garcia missed that punch. Arrow Spence is regrouping. He's got to jump right back on him. Or he's got right there. So he's got to start working inside. And stiff. He needs to move his head a little bit more. He's keeping the perfect distance. Errol Spence. And now he's. Body shot. Oh, oh left by Spence and then a right. Mikey took that hard shot well and came back with his own right hand left foot. And this is the Errol Spence. Oh, oh, good right hook by Errol Spence. But this is the champ, Mikey, coming back. He's not going to sit still for that. Down Ooh, to 20. Upper Harold Spence. But Mikey comes back. He'll counter. All right, Chris. How about you, Joe? Do you have Spence winning every round? Use a lot of jabs because it, it'll really keep Mikey at bay, which he's been doing all night. And even that great. He wants to be successful. Round seven. Winding down here in Arlington. But on those replays, it certainly looked like Errol Spence was laughing spectacular in the next few rounds. He's got to hurt Errol Spence, take his eye off the ball there, not with a guy like Spence. Look at the total number of punches landed, only 45. He got to see it because he's putting up that left hand, trying to block it, but a jab taking up all the time on your left hook side. You know what I mean? Oh, I buy right behind it. Ooh, oh, left by Spence. I think he gotta, uh, he's gonna have to rush him. But okay, he let's. Yeah, even when he fight, it's too far gone already. You know. Right, but he needs to throw some punches. At well, the beginning of this round, he's guys. looking. It seems like he's looking for that perfect punch, that perfect. It's hard to be careful in a fight. Um, There's his trainer, his older brother Robert. Well, he's landing there right now. Very solid stuff. Oh, left uppercut by oh. Spence. Spence turns on the heat. Lucky to this round. Final seconds of round nine. Like the kind of punches that he was getting hit with in that last round. Mikey asked him for this round. He punches most by a Garcia opponent in 20 fights. Attempt round here, and I'm talking about Mikey Garcia taking that type of punishment. Really devastates most of his opponents, whether it's to the body or head, but eventually he wears you down and just third. She's by Mikey Gar Garcia. And, uh, you know, he's known for his body punches. Yeah, he is. And he just got hit with a couple. At this point, it's only going to take one punch. Well, I got to tell you, Mikey threw a nice crisp left hook off. Mikey Garcia needs to knock out Errol Spence to win this fight. Of course. But right now, he's too busy protecting himself. Just here in round 11. It's not looking good. Well, he's looking for a counter shot. It was too little, too late. 
and punches, which is slowing him down. So anytime he attempts to throw a punch, so he's the guy that's a 135 pounder as well on the other side of the coin, right? Uh, Double protecting himself. Oh, coming up short on the challenge, but man, I mean, it takes a lot of guts and. Errol Spence Jr. at 24 and up. He popped out a couple of short right hands, but that's as much as he. The time together, they were out in Los Angeles on a couple of occasions, and earlier this week here in Arlington. Mike trying to go for broke right here and and close the show. Errol Spence Jr.